good guys welcome back to ron's rides welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where finally in front of me i have the 2019 maserati levante trofeo the big bad boy of maseratis now i'm at maserati ferrari of orlando i had to come out here to see it because there aren't any anywhere in florida there's one in fort lauderdale there may be one on the west side of the state but other than that this is the only one i've been able to find and i'm finally able to see it in person now if you guys are wondering why i'm doing a voiceover it's because of the fact that we got it outside for a quick moment just because a customer wanted to buy a ferrari f12 berlinetta so they had to move the trofeo outside for a moment while they moved that car but otherwise most of this video is going to be inside of the dealership. I'm going to do a voiceover because of the fact that they are doing business and um, you know, I would be disruptive if I was talking out loud throughout the whole video um, while filming. So I'm gonna show you all the details of the car. Obviously, you'll get to hear it. Start up with that first introduction and rev, um, and then you'll be able to see the interior and exterior bits of the Trofeo, but this is the one, the $173,000 car with options. So I'm gonna show you the sticker and everything a little bit later on so you guys can see it all. But this is it. What do you guys think? First couple of glances of it, of the Levante Trofeo. Um, as you can see, that engine is looking very pretty, especially outside, carbon fiber. All right, I mean, this is it. This is the V8. Let's give it a look and let's hear it. Levante Trofeo has some new exterior features like the new aluminum hood with the dual vents, carbon fiber splitter, front grille blades, the side skirts, rear balance, adaptive LED headlights, carbon fiber engine cover, Trofeo badging, and 22 inch wheels. But where it really shines is this right here your V8 3.8 liter, 590 horsepower, and 538 foot pounds of torque that does 187 top speed with a 3.7 second zero to 60. This is the bad boy right here. Ferrari built engine. I mean, you can really tell the inspiration here. You have the nice carbon fiber um, engine cover with the V8 badge on it. I mean, look at this thing. This looks beautiful. I really love how they did this engine block. And this is really where the Trofeo shines as opposed to the GTS that has the same kind of um, power in a sense, but just a little bit less, but the engine block doesn't look as good as this. Now your fuel economy for the Trofeo is 15 combined city and highway, 14 city and 18 highway. Obviously premium fuel for this V8. You're not gonna get a lot on the gas mileage, but you don't get a V8 super SUV for that. Now the Trofeo comes standard with 22 inch wheels, and these are staggered Odeone Miron wheels. They are wrapped in all season continental tires, and you have your six piston caliper Brembo brakes. You have the red caliper with the white Maserati script on them. I mean, these things are massive and they look amazing, very good fit for the wheel for this car. I think Maserati did a good job designing these. Now coming along the front fascia, you got your carbon fiber side blades. If you've seen the Levante GTS, you've seen the Trofeo, same layouts with the blades and the front lip and the Grand Sport look front bumper. The only difference is with the Trofeo, you get it in carbon fiber, but you're seeing a lot of the same design language. Big front open grille, um, you do have your black lip, but it's carbon fiber. You do have your kidney grills that have the air intakes in the middle. So you have the cooling. You also have the big Trident there that has the driver assistance package. So you have the big plastic Trident up front. Um, but like I said, you probably seen this before in my GTS reviews. Only differences is where you see the carbon blades on each side and the front lip. It's just done in carbon fiber. Now this Levante is finished in my favorite color, Bianco Alpi, which is a $1,775 option. And you do have a $400 black DLO with this, but look at this pearl paint. Just looks stunning even in the showroom. You do have the body color door handles as well, so you do not have the chrome with this. You also have 
the rear diffuser done in the same color matched Bianco Alpi. Now, a big difference here with the Trofeo is more carbon fiber. You're going to have the carbon fiber exhaust surrounds and you're going to have it during the middle of the diffuser. So you'll see the exhaust surrounds are very, you know, kind of styled like a sport look. And then you have right there in the middle of the diffuser going all the way across the carbon fiber. And you also have the black exhaust tips as well. So it's super sporty, really aggressive. And that's the way it should be for a car like this. This should be the pinnacle of what Maserati styling is going to be when you're in this type of price range. I really like the back of it. I really like the way it looks. I mean, it's it's pretty Maserati, but at the same time, you have those nice touches that lets you know it sets it apart, even the Levante little insignia there. Now that Levante insignia is special because you'll see it in the Trofeo badge in a second here to where it's strictly for the Trofeo, that underlining with the very sharp looking trident kind of look. Look at that under the underlining and it says Trofeo right over the top of it with the blue lines throughout the insignia. Up top, you do have the black roof rails and you have the panoramic roof stretching all the way across the roof. You also have the color match spoiler. So the spoiler is done in the Bianco LP paint, as you can see with the third brake light here. I do really love what the carbon fiber side skirts do to the side profile. Give it a little edgier look. You know, they're not just straight across. They have some design to them, but I really do like the way that these look, especially on that Bianco LP paint. Now, when it comes to cargo, you're looking at 20.5 cubic feet of space in your Maserati Levante uh, trunk. Now, you do have a 60-40 split, all right, 60% on the left-hand side and 40 on the right with the feed through in the middle. So you can put those golf clubs right through the middle if you need to. You also get these very nice Trofeo floor mats that are, you know, I mean, it's a nice touch. Nothing that I expected, but it looked good. Now underneath, you also have, like any other Levante, your stowage, and you have a couple extra tools. And then underneath this all, you do have your battery, and you have your spare tire with extra tools with that. Now, we'll go under that in just a second. Look under there, and there you are. So your extra tools, all right, your spare tire and your battery hidden underneath for your Trofeo. Now, looking at the passenger door, it looks very familiar, very GTS. Uh, not too much that we haven't seen before, but for 2019, they have the new stitching that really shows out on the doors. You do have the Bowers & Wilkins sound system here, upgraded sound system, the best you can get in the Maseratis, but I do really like that stitching, carbon fiber, aluminum. You do have the Maserati side sill plate as well. Looks very good. Just something unique. And then you do have the Trofeo badge for the Trident there stitched in. Now that is only something you're gonna get, obviously on this model. Looks very good. Prima Forte natural leather. We've seen this before, um, but you get it standard in the Trofeo. It's just something very nice, something very, very classy. Now you do have the carbon fiber and aluminum going all throughout the cabin, but a lot of you've seen before, carbon fiber trim, chrome, aluminum. I mean, everything that, you know, we've kind of touched over, but just now here in the Trofeo. Now in the back, you do have your vent shade there. Keep everything nice and cool. You have that same stitching, that same aluminum, and that same carbon fiber carried on throughout the back door paneling. All right, it looks very clean. And you have that Bowers & Wilkins sound system still carried on back here. Those speakers look awesome with the gloss black surround. Then you have your heated seat controls as well. Trofeo stitching in the back for the Trident as well, and that Prima Flore natural leather. I mean, everything looks like the back that it is up front. I mean, it just, it really meshes well together. You get the same treatment in the back as you do up front. I really like how they did it. There's your center feed through your trunk there, and I mean, nothing much to it. You do have your HVAC controls here. You have the nice screen, all right? You don't get that with all Avantes, but this is Everything that you get on a Levante, all upgraded, so you get your HVAC screen there for your climate control. Now, right up front here, you're looking at the cabin, the new cabin for Maserati, and it is the special cabin for the Trofeo. A couple extra interior features is that natural leather we talked about, the Trofeo stitch headrest, the matte carbon weave that this one is not optioned with, and you have the course of driving mode with launch control, which we'll see in a second here. But you'll see the same thing we saw on the passenger side is that Piano Florida natural leather with that stitching. You do have your aluminum pedals 
underneath as well and then you have stuff like you've seen before your um, ski knobs and your switches and everything like that your light switches here and your start button trofeo there in the middle a little bit of um you know customness to it you do have your nice sports steering wheel you have your driver assistance packages and you have your carbon fiber um, paddle shifters now in the middle here you have your carbon fiber center console all right you have your hvac controls your maserati touch control 8.4 inch screen there something we've seen before your alcantara pillars with your bowser wilkins sound system there and that red stitching with the leather going across the dash looks really good but again something we've seen before maserati clock in the middle very classic of maserati but it's a very good looking interior so far Taking a look at the top, you do have your sunroof controls, you have your home link, you have your reading lights, you have your dome lights, and you have your parking sensors right at the top of the headliner there. You also have your mirror with your visor here, done in Alcantara. I mean, looks like a normal mirror visor. Um, there's nothing crazy, but the Alcantara wrap looks very classy. And then you do have your reading light right above it there. Now in the center here, obviously you're gonna have your parking, electric parking brake hazard button. You have your air ride adjustable suspension, but you have something like your Corsa mode, which is your special driving mode, new for the Levante Trofeo and only for the Levante Trofeo. Skyhook performance suspension with electronic dampening control. Your Q4 intelligent all wheel drive system with limited slip diff. Integrated vehicle control for improved driving dynamics. I mean your off-road mode traction off your ice mode, which is increased efficiency You got everything here. Love it carbon fiber center console underneath some stowage You have your USB port your SD card and your aux cable there and then your cup holders here Covered up very Italian cup holders very small. You have your center armrest here All right, not as much space as you would like but Maserati does need to fit that 8-speed ZF transmission somewhere So this is the kind of space you'll get in your center armrest LED headlights You've seen from the Levante in the past look very sharp very aggressive Very good for the car and then you do have the LED taillights that you've seen from the Maserati Levante before looks very aggressive as well now let's talk about the sticker and those options on the Maserati Levante. All right, here's the moment of truth. What makes this 2019 Maserati Levante $173,000? Well, here's the sticker. You're looking at an exterior Bianco LP paint with the interior of Nero and Rosso. All right, your engine Italy, your transmission Italy, and your final assembly in turn Italy with 169,980 MSRP. After options, you're looking at $173,000. $650. All right. And that's with your preparation and delivery and your destination charges at $1,195 and $300. Now, the Levante name is the wind, Mediterranean wind, uh, blowing across the Mediterranean. Now, what you're looking at is the Levante Trofeo SUV that expresses that same kind of power capable of transforming and beginning to calm a raging storm in an instant this is what maserati really wants you to feel when you're in this levante now here are your standard options these are your additional options which we already talked about which was the paint all right the tri-coat paint and the black dlo other than that i mean the other stuff is really you know just not options it's just there you just decide if you want to change them out or not but it comes standard with everything now this is your standard options that it comes with which is pretty much like I mean, your max amount of options there's really nothing else you can get besides your different paint colors on this thing in your dlo but other than that this comes with every single thing carbon fiber, 22 inch wheels. I mean, your Bowers and Wilkins system, your Maserati touch control plus system, um, navigation, whatever you think. I mean, it's just heated seats, cooled seats, um, the, the top leather for the Piano Florida natural leather, everything. And you obviously, obviously have your warranty, four years, 50,000 mile bumper to bumper. And then you do have your gas mileage, which we talked about earlier. For an extra $50,000, this is 40 miles per hour faster than the GTS six miles per hour top speed faster than the gts and 0.3 seconds zero to 60 faster than the gts but is it worth the extra fifty thousand dollars when they look exactly the same so there it is behind me finally the maserati levante trofeo i had to come out to orlando but here it is i finally was able to present it to you guys now you have to let me know what do you think about the trofeo after seeing it hearing it 
and seeing that price. What are you guys thinking about that Maserati SUV? This is something different from any other SUV out there on the market. It's really close to the GTS, besides the differences that I've shown you, like the carbon bits on the exterior, um, the Trofeo lining on the stitching of the seat, the Trofeo badges, Trofeo in the infotainment cluster, stuff like that, and obviously the engine is gonna be the biggest sell point. But what did you guys think about the Maserati Levante Trofeo at $173,000? You guys let me know. If you guys wanna check out that vehicle, there's not too many in Florida, maybe about two or three. So if you guys wanna check out that one, I'll leave the links down below for Ferrari Maserati's contact information so you can get at them in the description below. I mean, it's something that you guys really need to just check out and come see for yourself because hopefully you guys enjoyed the video today if you did give that video a like it helps me in the rankings help support the channel um, so definitely thumbs it up there um, you can also check my social media links down below you can check out my facebook instagram snapchat all that good stuff keep up to it the memes and the videos and the pictures i'm posting of different car content you can also check out my one-time donation through paypal if you want to donate a dollar two dollars three dollars whatever you guys want to do also have the patreon down below if you guys want to contribute there appreciate it so much just thanks for spending your time with me i'm um, definitely subscribe for more ron's rides videos you can click that notification bell to get those videos right in your inbox hopefully you guys enjoy finally seeing the levante trofeo right up front and hearing me talk about it and just really explain everything to you guys now with that said you guys be blessed be good and we'll see you guys in the next ron's rides video drive safe peace